so welcome back to my channel my name is Jane and if you're new here welcome to my channel for today's video I am planning to do a monthly reset literally March is coming up tomorrow so I just want to do my monthly reset ahead of time and also honestly this is my first time doing this so hopefully it will get into me and it will be a routine because it really sounds healthy in a way where you get to organize things plan things ahead so I would say it's really worth it so yeah that's what we're gonna do today and I also made a list of what I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna put it up on the screen here so what I have here on the list this is not in order by the way so first we have the digital vision board so this is like a monthly vision board of something that you want to envision for this month or something you want to happen for that month and next is laundry so basically I'm just gonna be washing my blankets my bed sheets and also of course my clothes and then next is clean my room so I'm not gonna go that crazy cleaning my room but I'm probably just gonna be throwing some trash I'll like rearrange some stuff and um, yeah and then next what I have here is plan goals for this month so basically I'm gonna be doing like a monthly planner do some to-do list, post what things I needed to do that month, post up appointments or my work schedule so that it will just be there and it will be easy for me to track what my life is gonna be ahead of me. So yeah. And then next is digital declutter. So basically I'm just gonna be going through my emails, delete some emails that of course that are spams or unsubscribe to some emails so that you won't get more trash or more emails that you won't even read and then also delete some pictures of course to free more space next is update my spotify playlist so i really love spotify i decided every month i would go through the, those playlists and see if i still want those songs or i want to add more songs and something like that and then next is self-care of course like it's very important to start things with self-care honestly i think that's one of the things that you should do because if you feel good then you do good does that make any sense like if you feel good you can do things like in your best way possible if that makes sense i mean that's how i feel so i have like the sub points here like workout skincare vitamins and hydrate don't forget your water it's really important and yeah that's all what i have here and I'm really excited to make this video and let's do this. Also, I know you guys don't know about this, but I'm currently in the basement and that's why I'm here in the basement because this is also where we have the gym that we have. It's not particularly a gym, but I don't know how you call it. This is like an extra room where all of the house intestines are here. I will make more sense. Like, if you get what I mean? Like you see the emphasis of the house. Like, and then we just have the weights here, some equipments there, another, you know, some dumbbells, and then, of course, treadmill, another weight. 
hopefully that made sense but yeah that's what i'm trying to say so so that it will be just easy for me to go back and forth and yes and also what i'm currently doing now is just my normal morning routine like washing my face and my skincare drinking my vitamins and also what i'm gonna do in a bit is i'm gonna be doing my workout but before that i'm just gonna drink coffee because i need to be up this is my coffee start i'm just gonna, i just want to show you guys my spotify i'm just gonna go to my gym and workout playlist and then let's get jamming yeah i have actually so many songs that i'm gonna take out here because i usually skip some of them what's the point of having a playlist if we're just gonna skip this song to my room and, and I don't know if you can see it yet but it's pretty much dirty hold on let me just go over the checklist that I made so now I'm just gonna be doing my laundry first actually I'm just gonna do my laundry first so that I'm able to clean the things up here so I'm just gonna wash my bed sheets which is like my pillow sheets my my blankets and then my laundry So since I'm just waiting for my bed sheets to finish washing, I'm just gonna be doing my room. So I'm just gonna be cleaning up my messy room as you can see here. Why? Literally Jane, why? So that's the current state. So yeah, so you guys already saw what's the current state of my room, so I think first things first is that I'm just gonna pick up some things on the floor first. So I'm just gonna get some trash bag, get those trashes up, and also just some of the clothes that I need to put in my laundry because some of them are dirty. Also, look at my Skims package. It arrived yesterday and I'm literally so excited to wear them. 
It's just on the floor because I don't know why, but I got this last night. Oh my god so i basically went to the era store let me just kneel down so I, I went to the era store last year in may at atlanta and then of course they have like this concert bracelet that lights up and then i saved this thingy how do i say it I don't plastic thing that you can slip on inside and then when you take it out it literally lights up like can you see it so yeah, this is just like a little tip and trick if you want to save your concert lights. Just save this little thingy and put it back. You just slip it on here and you just turn it off and you save the battery life for this one. So. One of the things that will happen when I clean, I get distracted. So when I was cleaning up my bag in my closet, I saw a receipt. Then it says here, Abo the Museum. And then this is actually in Sweden when me and my family went to Sweden. So basically, yeah, it's just so cool. I'm just gonna save this to my memory box real quick. Access done. Also, that's why I also have this in my closet because I'm pretty sure you guys don't know yet, but I am going to Aruba this April, first week of April. And then my best friend who lives there literally requested me to bring up like a bag of, of sour candies. So I bought one on Amazon. This is what it looks like. I'm basically done with my room so these things that are left on my bed are just the stuff that I'm so gonna put on my bed anyway so that's why it's just there and then you see on this side this on this stack these are just like stack of pillows and of course these are the pillows that I'm just gonna put on my bed and 
I'll just sell the Lion Camp and then here's my jacket. Yeah, I'm basically done it on the floor here, but I'm just gonna throw them anyways along with the bottles. And I also have the trash here. Trash. So basically I'm just gonna throw them out later before I go to work because I go to work at four and I'm basically leaving at 3.30, so I'm just gonna be doing that during that time. just do the checklist of what do we have done so far all right so we already cleaned the room and then for the laundry we're just waiting for it to be done it's still actually still in the washer it's still not done so I just check up on how many minutes left for it to be done in the washer it says 10 minutes so I'm just gonna be waiting for about 10 minutes and then go back to the washroom go put it to the dryer and then put my clothes that need to be washed so yeah so yeah now we have that laundry is ongoing so now for the next step, my wallpaper, monthly board. So let's do this now. So for the monthly vision board, I'm just gonna be doing this on my iPad and then I'm just gonna be searching some photos on Pinterest because Pinterest is your girl when it comes to vision boards. Put March finished my March vision board it's just simple and it's just um things that I just really want to maintain or achieve this March so it just says here good things are coming and of course we have the money we have the YouTube plaque but of course we're not there yet but it's just something that I just want to be reminded of that to be consistent and to not stop doing what you want and then we got these, of course, I'm consistent. And then just a self-care here, another self-care on this side, and then just water because I just want to stay being hydrated. And then it just says here, positive energy and just some healthy bowl. And then just there, be happy. So those are just some simple things that I want to achieve or maintain this March. And yeah, I'm just going to change them past my wallpaper now. So cute! I'm just gonna screenshot that up. So this is where I already got my iPad wallpaper and I'm just gonna change it on my iPad because I just love how my wallpaper already looks like on my laptop and also on my phone. So I'm just gonna do it on my iPad. Now we're just gonna mark off the wallpaper monthly board on the to-do list. So already check that out. And then now I'm just gonna check up on my laundry if it's already done so that I can move it to the dryer. So. All right, so since now we're, we're still waiting for the laundry to be done, I just check up on it. It says four minutes left. Like, it literally said 10 minutes when I check up earlier. And then now it's a, it says four minutes. There's no way I did all of my vision board wallpaper thingy under, or in six minutes, so that doesn't make sense. But anyway, so I'm just going to go on and do the other checklist that we did. So I'm just going to do the setting up on my monthly planner. 
like where I put my work schedule, some of the things that I needed to do this month. So, so that I can just like see the layout throughout the month. What I'm going to use, I'm just going to use the Notion. I'm just going to go on my Notion template that I got. I don't know where I got it, but I'm pretty sure it's free. And I found it on the Notion template thingy. Or, I don't know, someone else's. But I really forgot where I got it, but this is what it looks like. It just says um, Jay's Planner. And then it just says the Daily Tracker. Oh, wait, hold on. I can't really see. Yeah, Daily Planner, Weekly Planner. The monthly planner, the task tracker, and then the habit tracker. I rarely use these two, so it's just the, the daily planner, weekly planner, and the monthly planner that I usually do. So I'm just, first I'm gonna do is just, I'm just gonna put up the days where I'm gonna work. And also I'm just gonna put some things that I needed to do this month. So basically, maybe some appointments, but so far I don't have appointments coming up, so probably anytime soon. If I get one, that's what I'm gonna do now, so. Yeah. Alright, so I pretty much finished um, putting on my schedule on my planner, which is good. I already envisioned. What is that a word? I can I can already vision. There we go. The things that are going to happen in my month. But basically, most of them are just work, but I'm going to add something if some things come up. But so far, this is what I have for now. And then I just put on my monthly planner, just some personal things. I just put save money because I have some trips coming up and I really need to do that. And then I just put some reminder at work during Wednesday and Friday. I work full day and then I work straight from Wednesday to Sunday. And that's about it for now. But yeah, I'm just gonna put that on my checklist. Just gonna check that out on my notes. Oh yeah, I forgot, shoot. So I'm actually leaving for Aruba on this April 1st. So I probably need to do like a prep thingy. I'm gonna do that now. So I'm just gonna add some things because I'm for sure I'm gonna be filming a video. Something like prep and pack with me to Aruba or to my this, that, that, whatever vacation. But yeah, let me do that. I'm gonna start packing a month. A week before so that I don't really have to panic because I get bad with packing and sometimes I'd forget stuff so start packing and also film video all right so now what I'm going to do is that I am going to update my Spotify playlist <laughs> If you want to know my Spotify, this is my Spotify right here. Feel free to follow me up there. And I have so many playlists for different moods. So feel free to listen to those music. I'm just going to update some of my playlists. just a very quick update we're pretty much almost done so I already updated some of my Spotify playlist some of them I didn't even add songs I just removed the songs I just added some of the songs and removed some songs and that's about it and also I already did my decluttering my digital decluttering which I deleted some of my emails and also I subscribed on some of my emails and I also did deleted some of the pictures that I know I won't even use anymore most of them are just the screenshots that I took when I needed them and yeah we're pretty much done so I'm just gonna be checking off some of the lists so literally the one left is a laundry literally the only one thing left is laundry it's been taking a while oh my gosh i didn't know it would take that much but i'm pretty much done i'm here in my bare bed just waiting for my bed sheets to be done to dry and also for my clothes it's currently a washer but yeah when everything's done with the laundry i'm just gonna bring it back to my room put it on my bed again also fold the clothes that i have but i don't think i'll have time to fold those clothes because i have an upcoming work soon so i'm probably gonna be doing that on saturday because i can't really do it tomorrow because i work full day tomorrow so i really don't have time but if i do get the time tomorrow i'm gonna do it of course but yeah pretty much that's about it i'm probably gonna see you guys when i'm gonna put up my bed sheets <laughs> So 
so now I'm just gonna be doing like a reflection of what I did today while I'm gonna be getting ready because I really need to get ready because I have work anyways I would say it is something that I would do all over again it is very motivating like you're you have like this mindset it's like a monthly reset so you have like this chance to go over things that you didn't do so you know like doing this and that like washing the bed sheets cleaning your room if that's something that you're procrastinating about do it it will literally motivate you and i'm actually happy that i did it and i participated to this monthly reset i never thought that i would do it like I thought of it, but I was like, mm, I don't think I'll do it anytime, you know? Hi guys, I'm pretty much done getting ready. So I'm basically just gonna show you guys like the room. So starting from the bed, there's my bed right there. And of course I just have the keys out and also my bag I'm gonna bring for work. And I just usually put my headphone here. And then what we have there, here is just my makeup. And then, of course, oh, sorry, my app is there, but of course, we have the, the top of my cabinet here. And then that's why I have these two mugs out because I'm actually gonna bring them downstairs so that I can use them. So I also have this Taylor Swift thing here. Yeah, basically, I, I didn't really touch anything here, so I just left it out. And here is the blanket. So this is the wet. Yeah, it's pretty much still wet. So I'm just gonna lay it there, I guess. I don't know. And let's see about that and then this is just the cover for this thing there that I'm using and then of course just my weight scale for me but I'm just gonna turn it off and then yeah everything and that's it and then I just have my scuba hoodie out because I'm gonna wear that to work and then yeah that's about it pretty much done um, thank you so much guys for watching this video I hope you guys had fun and I hope I get to inspire you guys to also do a monthly reset and actually it doesn't have to be a monthly reset I mean you really don't have to do it like monthly but it's really healthy mentally and physically and spiritually like seeing all these things cleaned up um resetting some of the things such as like deleting pictures making more space for your phone deleting the emails that you don't even look at or like unsubscribing some emails and also planning out your days um envisioning what your month will look like i would say that is really important and it's really healthy so i would really recommend it doing this routine but yeah, thank you again guys for watching. I hope to see you again for my next video. Bye.